While trying to teach Clara how to operate the TARDIS, the time machine was caught in a magnetic hobble field from a space salvage ship, operated by the Van Balen Bros. A future version of the Doctor arrived through a time rift, throwing his present self a magnograb remote with big friendly button, branded into it to stop the ship's magnograb. After the Doctor pressed the button, the TARDIS disappeared, escaping the Van Balens and preventing its engine failure. The Doctor said aloud to Clara that two days had been compressed into the space of one. The Doctor asked Clara if she felt safe traveling with him, and after a long conversation, she admitted that she did. In an alternate timeline, however, the TARDIS was successfully captured by the Van Balen Bros, causing the TARDIS to leak the past and future. In the confusion, the Doctor made it out of the TARDIS, while Clara ended up lost inside, her hand burnt by the scorching metal of a magnograb remote that had mysteriously appeared in the TARDIS and rolled towards her shortly before she was separated from the Doctor. Inside, she traveled through the TARDIS rooms, running away from a time zombie threatening to harm her. She eventually arrived in the TARDIS library and hid there. She read a book called The History of the Time War, and found out the Doctor's true name. She kept traveling inside the TARDIS, eventually arriving in an echo of the control room. She was pulled through to another echo room and reunited with the Doctor, meeting Bram and Tricky Van Valen. The Doctor switched off the countdown to the TARDIS's non-existent self-destruct sequence but realized that the magnograb had caused the engine to start malfunctioning. On the way to the center of the TARDIS, the four kept running from the time zombies and reached the cloister room, where they found out what the time zombies really were, them. The doctor managed to trick the time zombies and make them fall to their deaths inside the Eye of Harmony. The doctor and Clara ran to the heart of the TARDIS. There, the doctor told Clara about her uniqueness and about her multiple lives and deaths. The doctor found that the burn marks on Clara's hand had formed words, big friendly button. The doctor then realized they needed to go back to the point of the disaster and activate the Magno Grab remote, which had caused the burn marks on Clara's hand before, to stop the field and prevent the disaster. The doctor passed through a time rift to give the device to his past self, who successfully activated it, undoing the damage to the engine and making Clara forget about the doctor's name. The doctor did not want Clara to go searching for his name, because an important secret was connected to it. This adventure, although negated, was later recalled by Clara when the TARDIS leaked time energy.